as you may have heard, AI is having a very busy year. So we've got lots to talk about. Let's get started. We've been applying AI. We've generative AI. AI, AI, AI. Yes, it is the year of AI and Google is finding itself in a state of bewilderment as ChatGPT, a revolutionary AI, takes the stage by storm. With a race against time, Google scrambles to bridge the gap, striving to match the unprecedented speed and brilliance that ChatGPT has unleashed upon the world. Welcome tech aficionados to yet another episode of Tech Tales. Today we take an exclusive peek into the exciting realm of Google search. Brace yourselves for a roller coaster ride as we uncover the mind-boggling changes that will revolutionize the way you query the Google search engine. Don't miss a beat. Hit that subscribe button below and join our community of tech enthusiasts as we dive deep into the world of cutting-edge innovations and unveil the future of search. Let's get started. On May 10, 2023, the tech world's spotlight shone brightly on Mountain View, California as Google hosted its highly anticipated annual developer conference. The opening keynote stuffed the audience with a flurry of exciting revelations. I took center stage as Google immersed themselves deeply in the realm of generative computing, the company proclaimed its decades-long dominance in the field of AI technology. You probably do not have time to watch the two-hour presentation, so here is what is changing to Google search in a few minutes. With the torrent of projects, Google is devising radical search changes to beat back AI rivals like OpenAI and Microsoft. In March 2023 revelation, Google's employees were left astounded as news circulated that South Korean consumer electronics giant Samsung was contemplating a switch from Google to Microsoft's Bing as the default search engine on its devices. According to internal messages, the unexpected news sent shockwaves through the ranks. An estimated $3 billion contract with Samsung and an additional $20 billion contract with Apple and annual revenue was at stake. Tension sparked leading to discussions and anticipation regarding the potential ramifications for Google's dominance in search business for the past 25 years. Google has a comeback and this is huge. AI is coming to search results. Google is building an all new search engine powered by AI technology. It is also upgrading the existing one with AI features. They call it Project Maggie. Google has been experimenting with AI for years. Its London-based DeepMind lab is one of the best AI research labs. They had hit glitches such as bad result generation that made them halt full adoption. But the current battle is to win control. Google released its own chatbot, Bard, but the reception was underwhelming. Two main features that Google is implementing in its search engine surrounds better understanding of content and the context of an image the user is viewing in the search results. To be released in the next months, this includes the addition of more background information about the image itself within and about this image feature, as well as new markup in the file itself that will allow images to be labeled as AI generated. Specifically, it will include information like when the images and similar images were first indexed by Google, where the image may have first appeared online, and where else the image has been seen online. The latter could include things like news media websites or fact-checking sites, which could potentially direct web searchers to learn more about the image in question including how it may have been used in misinformation campaigns. To use about this image, Google explains users will have to click on the three dots on an image in the Google Images search results, search with an image or screenshot on Google Lens, or swipe up from within the Google app when you're on a page with an image you want to learn more about. In the coming months, a user will also be able to access the feature by right-clicking on long pressing on an image in the Google Chrome web browser across mobile and desktop too. Google says several publishers are already on board to adopt this feature, including Midjourney, Shutterstock, and others. While Google is being proactive in introducing the tool before the world becomes fully inundated by AI-generated imagery that isn't immediately obvious at first glance, like Pope Francis in a puffer jacket or Trump and Biden as best friends. It's also another example of how AI technologies have been released into the wild before robust systems have been put into place to mitigate the potential damage they can do. I'm just so excited by the potential of bringing generative AI into search. Google is also experimenting with a new AI-powered conversational mode in search. This new experience comes with an integrated search results page so that you can get more out of the single search. Users will be presented with suggested next steps while conducting a search accompanied by an AI-powered snapshot of crucial information to consider. With provided links to explore further, users can dig deeper into the subject matter. By tapping on a suggested next step, search seamlessly transitions into a new conversational mode empowering users to engage with Google and gain additional insights on the topic they are exploring. 
The contextual thread seamlessly carries over from one question to another, ensuring a fluid and coherent search experience. This immersive experience seamlessly integrates with Google Shopping, aiming to swiftly link users with useful information online. Let's say you're on the hunt for a new bike. With this enhanced experience, you'll receive a comprehensive overview of crucial factors to consider, along with a curated selection of products that perfectly align with your needs. Within the interface, you'll have the freedom to ask follow-up questions or select from suggested next steps. For instance, if you're curious about the availability of new colors for the bike, Search will understand your intention, recognizing your focus on specific bike models. This is based on the Search Generative Experience experiment. This new generative AI shopping experience is built on the robust foundation of Google's Shopping Graph. With an impressive database containing over 35 billion product listings, this innovative technology sets the stage for an unparalleled shopping journey. Harnessing the immense power of data, Google aims to deliver a comprehensive and personalized shopping experience, elevating user satisfaction to new heights. The user in the US will be able to test this feature on an experimental basis through Google Labs in the coming weeks. By harnessing the latest generative AI capabilities, Google is revolutionizing the search landscape, aiming to alleviate the burden of searching for users. This transformative technology empowers users to understand a topic faster, explore fresh perspectives and insights, and accomplish tasks with greater ease. In this enhanced generative experience, search ads will still appear in dedicated ad slots on the page. However, Google emphasizes its commitment to ensuring a clear distinction between ads and organic search results, prioritizing transparency and user experience. Is this enough response by Google to Microsoft Bing and OpenAI's chat GPT? Let me know in the comments section. Thank you for watching and watch out for the next episode of Tech Tales.